Hi everyone, welcome back to Cody's Lab. So I have up here a strong magnet suspended from a wire. You see there's a piece of plastic here and a little dish which I'll be putting liquid nitrogen in. And finally this which you may recognize from my intro. This is a piece of dysprosium metal. So I'm going to put that in here, push it underneath the magnet. You can see that it is not attracted. It does not attract the magnet because dysprosium is non-magnetic but at room temperature. If I cool it off to below 88 Kelvin, dysprosium will actually become magnetic. So put that underneath the magnet, and as you can see, it stuck right to it. Now, once that cools back off below 88 Kelvin, it should drop off of that and fall back into the liquid. Yep, there it goes. Yep, fell back in, and it come back up because it cooled off in the nitrogen. This works because of the Curie point of the metal. As the metal warms up, it no longer is able to maintain the magnetic orientations, no longer able to become magnetic. But once it's cold, it becomes magnetic again. Oh, ran out of nitrogen. Let's put some more nitrogen in there and see if we can get it to run for longer. There you go. Sticks to the magnet. Zoom in a little bit here. Warms up, becomes non-magnetic, falls off into liquid, cools off, and becomes magnetic again. Isn't that cool? Alright, looks like I ran out of nitrogen again. Hope you guys enjoyed, I'll see you next time.